In case of mechanical rupture or failure, the air starter can be easily removed on line. First, release the clamp of the lower air duct at the air starter inlet junction and discard the gasket. Hold the air duct and release the clamp at the start valve outlet junction. Then remove the air duct and the clamps. Release the quick detach clamp and disconnect the starter from its adapter housing. With the starter removed, it is possible to see the drive pad and the splines of the adapter where the starter is engaged. Also on the starter, you can see the turbine rotor section, the engagement splines and drive shaft. The installation of the starter is the reverse procedure. Note that during this task, new gaskets must be installed. 